Hey, what's up you guys? It's me, Tracy Lauren, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are building Caillou's home from the show Caillou, which aired on PBS. But before we get into the nitty gritty, and by the way, all the drama, yes, there's drama surrounding Caillou. <laughs> I want to know what are your opinions about Caillou and I'm not talking about the show I'm talking about the kid. What are your opinions now? Don't worry. Tell me what you think. We're all open here I'm very curious to know what your opinions are If you didn't know Caillou first aired on September 15th 1997 and the last time it aired was on October 5th 2010 now that's a very long stretch of time it personally covered a lot of people so there are people that did grow up with this show i personally didn't watch it as much i only know it by glance because my brothers grew up with it so i kind of saw it sometimes i really didn't sit there and watch it but it did stretch a lot of people now you guys as i was doing my research putting on my glasses and typing away <laughs> i found out some very juicy tea and i don't know if y'all ready for this but there's tea did you guys know that caillou is permanently canceled in the united states and they're not able to air any reruns are you guys shook by that i was shook i was like oh my gosh like what what happened like why was it canceled at first i thought oh it must be because of ratings you know the people that watch this are now adults and you know we're not watching Little Caillou and, you know, all those other shows because we're all adults here. But no, you guys, it wasn't because of that. It was because of the parents. Now, the parents complained and complained and complained that Caillou is a bad influence for their children. And at first I was like, Caillou is a bad influence for children? How is that possible? But y'all... I did my research. I did my due diligence. Wait, what is it called? Due diligence? I can't pronounce it. Due diligence. But I did the research. And let me tell you, Caillou, he has questionable behavior. Go out of my room. That's mine. No, I don't want to. Go away. Vegetables. I want chocolate chip cookies. Uh. Stay out. <laughs> and listen it's all good if you know you want your children to watch this but a lot of the majority of people thought that caillou's behaviors were rubbing off on their children and a lot of people on twitter voiced their opinion now here is one person saying bye bye have fun i'll just be over here celebrating that they finally canceled the show that taught kids how to be bratty Another person said, finally, that little nightmare has been grounded permanently. <laughs> and I read somewhere else online that someone described as described Caillou as the demon seed. They said, Caillou is a demon seed, lying to his mother, tormenting the family cat, and swatting his little sister with a buck. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Just kidding. So dramatic. But that is the reason why it has been canceled in the United States. Now, I understand that not all of my viewers are from the United States. If you're from another country, did they cancel Caillou where you live? Let me know. And if let me know if you're shocked by the news because I was completely shocked that they canceled the show. <laughs> now, for those that do not know, my introduction to Caillou was when I was a little older. I have, it's four of us, I'm the oldest and I have three younger brothers. Now, the third child grew up watching the show a lot, right? And he watched this with Teletubbies. It was like nonstop. It was not a good time for me. <laughs> Um, but he would watch Caillou all the time, and I never sat and watched a full episode, hence why I didn't know all the characteristics of Caillou. But one thing I did remember is that my little brother started talking like Caillou, right? Um, Caillou's voice is very, like, recognizable. To me, it sounds a little whiny. <laughs> And my brother started doing the same voice as him. And that I do remember like growing up, just remembering how my brother started acting like him. And 
you know, I remember the theme song. It was very catchy, by the way. It could get stuck in your head. And I'm sorry if you watched the intro and were like, oh no, like this song is going to be stuck in my head forever. <laughs> and another thing that I remember are the colors. Now, this show, they really love their blue, green, red, and yellow. Now, those colors are everywhere in this field in the exterior in each room it is crazy and trying to find those same colors or same furniture piece as well is difficult and you guys know i don't use cc in my builds i'm not about it nothing against people that do like cc in their builds but i personally i don't do it i do cc more for cast things right but oh my gosh, I'm telling you, it was so difficult to try to find things that are similar. And this kitchen is for one. Now, if you see the cabinets are green and red, are there cabinets green and red in The Sims? No, maybe there is in different packs, but your girl don't got all the packs, okay? Like I am not that wealthy. <laughs> I have a limited number of packs, so I gotta work with what I have. So these were the closest things that I could find. And I did a lot of this in the home, right? If I didn't have something that was that color or that shape of furniture, I tried my best to find the closest to it. And I hope you guys see that in the build. And if you are new to my channel, make sure to stick around for the visual walkthrough because I always give a visual walkthrough of the entire build. Now. I really tried my hardest, you guys, to get it as close as possible. And when you happen to download this build, make sure to tag me on Twitter. Um, let me know if you're satisfied with it because I love to hear from you guys. I love to know what you think of the builds and how you interact with them. I say that in every episode, but you guys, it really means the world to hear from you guys. <laughs> and if you haven't already, make sure to like and subscribe and ring that notification bell. It helps out the channel and it helps me out too. So thank you so much if you have done that in advance. Now. I do stream on Twitch. I stream Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and sometimes Fridays. Times do vary. Make sure to check the schedule on Twitch. And we also have a Discord. Please join. I have so much fun there. I'm primarily there talking to you guys, sharing memes and all that kind of stuff. Anyways, thank you so much for being here. I truly appreciate you. And I hope you enjoy the visual walkthrough in the end.